What is going on, Sheem Army? This is your boy Random Arts coming with a quick video. And on this video, guys, we're going to be talking about Shiba Inu, guys, and as well as about Shibarium. So make sure you guys watch this video all the way to the end so that way you can understand what I'm talking about. And that way you get a sense of what's going on right now in the overall ecosystem of Shib. So before I dive too deeply into this video, do me a huge favor by hitting that like button, hitting that subscribe button. And I definitely love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinion about Sheeb. Now, quick look at Bitcoin sitting at 70K. Uh, the markets in itself still have not been open um, for the stock market. It roughly opens in about 40 minutes or so. So we're going to see which direction that Bitcoin uh, want to go. Because with the market being open as far as in the stock market, you tend to do see a lot of uh, institutional money uh coming in as far as hedge funds because they do have to buy the bitcoin in order to be able to offer to their client so we don't know what how much orders are is pretty much on standby that's going to go out today so depending on buys or sales we could see bitcoin pop maybe above 72 73 or we could start to see it uh stay flat like we've been seeing it or even having a little slight correction but either way, we're seven days away from the Bitcoin halving. So still a lot of time before we really start to see uh, the pump of Bitcoin. Then eventually it trickles down, you know, to the alt, uh, to the alt tokens. Uh, one thing that I wanted to show you guys before I really get into the meat and potatoes of this video today is Jim's radar, guys. So killer, guys, was ranked number one as far as uh, best gym of the day, which was yesterday. Um, I thought that was pretty cool that, you know, we're getting that type of recognition. Um, and to follow that up with two guys, look how many soul killers being uh, burnt as well as bone. So far as 9,785 um, that's being burnt as far as uh, for bone. So this is pretty cool just to be able to see. And also, if we just take a quick look at the chart, we had this nice pop above this resistance area. Now, this resistance is acting as a support area. As long as we stay above it, then we could start to see us eventually testing these all time highs um, and potentially surpassing it. Uh, market cap of it is still extremely tiny. Um, H transaction, it is burning uh, soul killer as well as bone. So. This is definitely a good deflationary token. Um, so long-term holding is probably the key thing, at least for me, as far as what I want to do for this. So I'm super excited just to see how this project is progressing because there's more liquidity pools that's being added to it um, with different other tokens, which is crazy, guys. So this is going to be a very scarce token, especially when uh, more and more projects uh, you know, come out as far as like well more and more dollar flow start to come into shibarium but yeah that's what I, all i had to say so let's get really into the meat and potatoes of this video guys now shiba inu and i get it a lot of people i get you know like for me i'm heavily invested into bone um some people like well random arts you know i want to hear about shiba inu like it, don't look at it as we're talking about Shiba Inu because Shiba Inu is the macro guys, the macro things within the ecosystem. If Shiba Inu does well, Bone is going to automatically do well as well. Like with this article that was uh, actually written by Coindesk, it was talking, let me get it pulled up here. It was talking about Shibarium. Guys, it says Shiba Inu is the first layer to blockchain to join the media and entertainment association to develop blockchain technology for content security and distribution so what we want to see we want to see more and more articles like this because again coindesk is a huge media outlet with over three million uh people so the more and more they talk about shiba inu and connect it with shibarium because again they do not know that Shibarium and Shiba Inu is a thing. So Shiba Inu, and I like how they phrase it, Shiba Inu and its first uh, layer two, because now people are gonna be able to try to connect the dot and to be able to get more and more people onto the platform. So this is why we wanna see. Shiba Inu is the macro, Bone is the micro um, within the ecosystem. So 
the more and more we get talked about, the better and better it's going to be for Bone because we want to see that big adoption onto Shibarium. And this is the way to be able to get him in because, again, Shiba Inu is on virtually all the exchanges. And as we get more attention like this and they start talking about our layer two um, and how it's connected, you know, how Shiba Inu is connected. Then we're going to be able to see the listings that we've been wanting to see as far as like a Binance listing on Bone, um, a Coinbase listing. Because where attention goes in this crypto market, typically this is where you're going to start to see these major players start to follow as well. So just keep that in mind. So anytime that I see anything like this, um, I automatically is going to do, you know, like retweet because again, media companies they want attention more attention that they get more people see it so it's it's almost like another form of marketing guys um so one last thing that i do want to bring up um when it comes well matter of fact I, I forgot to mention this this part too as well which was really the big crucial part of this um with the cdsa um which we just partnered up with it's the people that's on there so Shiba Inu joins Apple, Amazon, Netflix, guys. So these are members within the CDSA. Um, not only that, BBC, Disney, uh, Longgate, NBC, Univ uh, Universal, uh, Skydance. These are big name in the entertainment business. And the fact that now we're getting, you know, some type of partnership or even on their radar, because again, if they're members, they know what is happening. We could see, you know, Shiba Inu get integrated onto some of these platforms. Because again, where attention is at, this is where you're gonna start to see um, people gravitate to. So I like this partnership. I like this as a thing, because at the end of the day, if more and more people find out about Shiba Inu, which is the door that opens them up to the ecosystem, then we're going to start to see people start to trigger down to Shibarium, to, um, to Bone. And at the end of the day, guys, this is going to help us all out. So, you know, don't look at it because I, I, that's one thing that I don't like when people try to make it like she versus Bone or she, Bone versus Leash. Now nah, it's a whole ecosystem. If one is successful the other one is going to be as well too and just to end off the video with this right here guys and this is in regards to finance listing um this was actually very encouraging because i tried to do the push as far as for people to be able to try to um vote for the uh binance next um you know for us to try to get listed on binance uh futures and we didn't really see a big result on that. But someone brought out the stats as far as the projects that got listed on Binance Futures. And these were some of their stats. So uh, TA, uh, TAO, their pick, as far as total pick, and they still got listed on Binance, was 18,767. Uh, Saga was 3,899. Um tnsr 2420 currently right now you know at the time that they posted this uh bone as far as current uh vote was at 17,859 so there's still a hope that we could still get listed because at the end of the day it is based upon merit um how they feel it's it's you know it's really up to them at the end of the day so seeing something like this definitely get keeps us in the game of us potentially uh seeing maybe a binance futures this month because um i think they do it like once a month so i'm gonna keep my eyes peeled uh hopefully this is what you know shaitoshi and the team has been getting cooked up with binance and that way we could uh be able to see more and more uh volume coming in onto this bad boy but let me know guys in the comment down below your thoughts your opinion about all this Random March signing off. Peace.